In this video tutorial, we're going to be talking about another example of the fundamental counting principle. So here we have a question. Find the number of different outfits that Paul can make from four sweaters in colors blue, black, white, and gray, three bottoms, jeans, dress pants, and khakis, and two shoes, sneakers, and dress shoes. So let's think about the number of sweater choices that Paul has. He's got four and the number of bottom choices that Paul has, which are three, and the number of shoe choices that he has, two. If we find the product, 24, that will tell us how many different outfits that Paul can put together. Now I can do the exact same, um, I can find the exact same answer, 24, by making a tree diagram, such as this. So this is the exact same question, just organized in a tree diagram. So as you can tell so far, there's many different options that he can create just by using the blue sweater. So just by using the blue sweater, if you look in the sample space, he has one, two, three, four, five, six outfit choices. Please excuse the barking in the background, those are my dogs. Now, if he changes his sweater choices to black, let's see how many choices now he can create with his outfits just by choosing the black sweater. In the sample space, he has one, two, three, four, five, six choices. However, he has more sweater choices. He's got a gray sweater choice. And in the sample space, he can also create six different outfits with the gray sweater. Last but not least, he has a white sweater that he can choose from. And in the sample space, you will see that he has six different outfits he can choose just by selecting the white sweater. So in total, if you count carefully, in total, in the sample space, we have 24 choices. So you could take the time to make a tree diagram to find all 24, or you can use the fundamental counting principle and simply multiply the number of choices of each event together to find 24 outfits.